Hey everybody, I'm Gabby. Welcome back to Taylor Toned. Hi everyone, welcome to your 30 minute follow along bar workout. Now this is a bar workout, but it's going to be completely barless today and you won't be needing any equipment. If you've not already, hit subscribe, press the bell so you get a notification every time you upload a brand new workout. As I said, you are going to be needing no equipment for today's workout, but I would advise you have something for underneath your knees, maybe a mat, maybe a carpet, just something to protect your knees. Very excited for this 30 minute bar class. Let's get straight into it. Coming into a standing position, I want you to reach your hands out to the side. Find nice deep breath, inhale in. Exhale, roll the shoulders down. Now lift the heels up and away from the floor. Then you're gonna bring your hands into a prayer position, push the palms together. Think about lengthening the body and lower the heels to the floor. Straight to leg lifts, up, up, go lift. Lift. Now I want you to push those palms together, roll the shoulders backwards and down for the next 30 minutes. You are not only going to strengthen up your body, create a lean, long, dancers-like figure, we're going to work on that posture, so grow nice and tall, crown of the head to the ceiling, let's go, energize up through your body, let's warm up, lift and lift. You have seven for the change, six, five for the squat it, four, three, two, one, bring the feet wider than the hips, hands go press, go drop, lift up, go drop, lift up. So the hips, they are sinking backwards, all four corners of your feet, they're on the floor. The knees glide over the top of the middle toe, hips push backwards, as you drop down, pull the belly button away from your thighs, drop, lift, down, up, go down, lift up. Okay, we're going to switch it up. Six more of these and we're going to switch it up. We're going to add a toe tap forwards in four, lift, three, then up. Go two, lift up. Now, on this one, drop, toe tap, drop, toe tap, but at the arms. Lift, push back, lift. If you can't quite get this coordination, do not worry if you're looking at me like Gabby. We're like two minutes in and you're already really challenging my brain. Good, but if you want to, don't worry, take that modification. Go back to that squat, lift, drop. Every time you push it up, grow nice and tall. Get that balletic intention of growing longer, leaner, stronger, lift, four, push up. You got it, three, lift, two, lift, last one, now. Squat, hold. Incline that for the body forward. Sink into those hips. You'll feel that heart getting nice and high, the heart rate getting high. Sink the hips down. All four corners of your feet are on the floor. The arms reach forwards, back, forwards, back. So now you're getting a little bit of shoulder work. We are gonna come into that arm section in just a second. So let's warm up the body. Now don't let the head collapse down. Keep a nice neutral spine. Eye line is forward, just in front of your toes. Think about that straight back position. Sing those hips low, yes. I know those thighs should be bending and your heart rate should be up. We go, reach back. Reach forwards, let's do this four. Woo. Three, reach forwards. Two, reach forwards. Last one, now keep the hands over the top of the head. Sing those hips lower, give me. Seven seconds in a squat hold. Six, five, incline and up in four, in three, in two, one. Now don't come out. You're gonna bring the hands to the side. Straight away, bring the feet under the hips. Lift the body up and hold here. Now the heels are on the floor right now. Let's go arm section. We squeeze. Right elbow, reach. Left elbow, reach. Fingertips, they come in line with the shoulders. Elbow squeeze behind, reach. Behind, reach. Now just keep going with this for a little second. Behind, reach. I'm loving my playlist by the way today. I spent ages making this playlist. I subscribed to this thing called Epidemic Sounds. This isn't a paid advert by the way. I just subscribed to this £10 a month. And they get really, really good music lately. Squeeze, reach, let's go. One more, then both hands. Behind, 
Breathe. Now keep the shoulders rolled backwards and down. Squeeze your scapula together. The scapulas are those bones in the bottom of and the, in the middle of your back that are like wings. Squeeze them together. Work your lats by really squeezing through the back. Lats your biggest muscle in the back. Let's make them work for you today. Roll the shoulders backwards and down. Squeeze. Reach. You've got it. Four. You have three. Let's do this, two. Now, last one, you're gonna keep the hands out to the side. I'm gonna turn side on so you can see what I'm doing. You stay right there. You're gonna sweep the arm backwards, lift, and then open the heart, come forward. Bend through the knees, keep the abs pulled in. Open, bring the hands forward and out. Incline forwards, lift. Woo! Exhale, shine the heart forwards. Keep a bend through the knees. Don't let the neck flop around. You want to keep it nice and strong. Neutral spine. Reach forward. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Reach one more. Now this one, you're going to hold the hands behind yourself. You want to incline the upper body forward. Pull the abs in right now. The palms lift, 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 lift. Now it doesn't feel like much here, but you need to push. Right now, squeeze. <laughs> squeeze the palms up to the ceiling as heavy as you can. The heaviest thing you've ever lifted is pushing up. Up to your working triceps. Arms and shoulders should be burning. Let's go lift. Push the heavier you push, the more you work with your own resistance, your own body weight, the tougher it's gonna get. The tougher it is, the more it burns, the more you shake, the better results. You have seven, six, incline up with the hands in five, in four, we've got it, three, two, hold. Now, incline the body up, press the palms out. Stay there. The palms, you're gonna go, then press forward, then press back. Go forward, back. Forward, back. So I want you to every time you rotate the palms backwards, get the palms facing the back wall behind yourself or whatever's behind you. Get the palms facing there. We go bend press, bend press. So it's that microscopic bend through the elbows, almost invisible. You're elongating your arm muscles right now, taking an eccentric movement. We go bend reach, bend reach. You've got it. Seven. Six, five, holding back in three, two, one, turn the palms backwards, I know, little pinky, it's facing to the ceiling, shoulders they roll down, now little squeezes, back, you stay there, I'm just showing you what to do, we go push back, push back, press back, now squeeze, heavy, woo, let's go, squeeze, squeeze, you have just eight, Seven, shake it off in six, in five, in four, in three, push, two, one, well done. Straight away, down to the floor. So you're gonna bring yourself onto your forearms. Forearms go down to the floor. The feet tuck under, push back into a modified, into what's a forearm plank. Now lower down into a modified plank, bring the toes in. You want the fleshy part of your knees right now. Tuck the toes under, lift the knees, lower down, pull the toes in. Tuck, under, lower, squeeze. Tuck, under, lower, squeeze. Now just keep going for a few sets of this. Squeeze. As you tuck the toes under, the abs stay pulled in. I want a neutral spine. You are elongating crown of the head all the way down to those heels. I want no duck impressions. You're not in the pond. You're with me in this Taylor Tone workout. So get a gorgeous neutral spine. If you can feel it on that lower spine, in the lumbar spine, try tucking the tailbone under. Tuck, lift, lower, squeeze. Three more of these. You've got it. Squeeze two more. Tuck, lift, lower, squeeze. One more. Tuck, lift. Lower, squeeze. Now tuck the toes under, lift into your forearm plank. You have a number 11 with your forearms right now. Abs are in. You want your elbows under the shoulders. 
if you push back, you'll really, really, really challenge your upper abs. So you want shoulders over the top of your elbows, right fingers, fingertips, left elbow. You're gonna roll and now reach the top hand up to the ceiling, side plank. Float the arm over, down towards your hip. Flow the arm over. Now the whole time, make sure you are driving your underneath hip away from the floor. You want your hips stacked. By that, I mean one hip is on top of the other hip. We go over the head. Woo, reach to the side. Let's go. Three more of these. Over to the side. Two more. Over the head. Reach to the side. One more. Over the head. I'm learning. Reach to the side. Now hold the hand up. I give me seven, six, stillness five, center and four. Forearm plank in three, two, one. Back to a forearm plank. Do not drop those knees. I know you are burning. Squeeze the abs in. Inhale, exhale. Seven seconds of stillness. And then the other side. Five, inner five, squeeze, glute, squeeze. Four, three, other side in two. One, left fingertips, right elbow. Roll, reach, over the head, step onto the hip, over the head, keep driving the underneath hip away from the floor, modification, this knee lowers down, wherever you are, this top hip bone is pushing as high as you can, up to the ceiling, now really drive the hip high, this is sculpting you an hourglass figure, you are not only working on your waist, internal, external obliques, you're working into some shoulder stability, toning the upper body. Sweep to the side, one more, over the head. Whoo, sweep down. Now you're gonna lift the hand to the ceiling, send that top hip up. Give me seven, six, center in five, I know. Four, three, two, one. Through the center. Oh my golly gosh, I am burning too, do not worry. I line in between your fingertips right now. You're gonna go ahead and tap, right knee, left knee, right knee, left knee. Now keep the abs squeezed in. If you can't feel it, your hips may be too high. One straight line, option here. We can do it, we're in it together. I am burning too. Let's go double time, cardio burst. Tap, tap, tap. Inhale, exhale. Remember, do not hold the breath. You need to get oxygen around the body to all of your muscles to be able to give this workout 100%. You have 10, nine, eight, chance pose in seven, tap the knees, six, five, push back in, four, four three, two, one. Well done. Toes together, open the knees, push the hips back with lengthen through the spine. Inhale in. Exhale, now really stretch out the spinal column. Reach the hands forwards, extend the crown of the head forwards. Hands come in line with the shoulders. Lift up, inhale. Exhale, push it backwards. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, push back. Now inhale, lift. You're gonna bring your hands directly underneath your shoulders. I want you to walk back onto the fleshy part of your knees. So if you're having a mirror around right now, make sure you don't look like this. You won't do anything. Crown of the head down to your knees is in one straight line. That will mean your eye line is just forward in front of your fingertips. Hands under the shoulders. We're going tricep push-ups. Tricep push-ups. Then you're gonna squeeze elbows to waistline. Down for two. Now push up. Lift. We go down down, push, press. So, you will not get as low as a normal push-up unless you are like mad crazy fit. You'll be able to go all the way down here. Wherever you can get, just give me everything. Down, push, lift. Woo. Down, down, push it up. Three more, down, down, stick with me. We're in it together, two more, down, down, push, one more, woo! Now hold, bring the hands now a little bit wider than your shoulders. Single count down, single count up. Push up, elbows go in a V behind yourself. Bend, press, we have this. 
Do not let your neck hang. Eye line in between your fingertips. Let's strengthen those arms. Let's tone your body. Have you got something special coming up? Maybe you've got, I don't know, a holiday, a wedding. You need to look great. Commit to your workout today. Go bend, push, three, two, now one. Hold as low as you can. Again, eye line between your fingertips. Little pulse, little squeeze. You have seven, six, push back in five. Oh my gosh, four, three, two. Oh, I have no words. Roll the shoulders round. Sweep the feet forward. Bring the feet down in line with your hips. Fingertips come to heels. Now lift the hips, bend, push. Tricep dips on the floor. If you want this harder, I don't know, maybe you're thinking, Gabby, this is even hard today. Look at you, because I'm burning. Rock the weight backwards. Want it easier? Rock the weight forwards. Still, really find them as tough. Hips just on the floor. Pick your options, bend. Press, biggest bend, biggest press. You have two. Now hold a bend. Little pulse, little bend. Micro bend of the elbows. You have six, five, four, five section, three, two, one. Oh, find a word, sweep the feet round behind yourself. Bring it downward dog. Tuck the toes under, drive the heels. Walk the hands into your feet, little bend through the knees. Roll yourself all the way up. Feet come back into a squat position. We're gonna go squat, right leg lifts. Okay, so clasp the hands together or bring those hands to a prayer. It's up to you where you go. My legs are burning already. Why is that? Maybe it's because I went on a massive hike the other day. It really burned my legs. We go down, lift doms, delayed onset muscle soreness. That was me, that is me today even. We go down, lift, four, three, keep the abs in, two, one. Now hold the squat position, sink the hips down. The weight comes into your left leg. Push the hands to a prayer, lift the leg to the side. Float it up, tap it down. Float it up, tap it down. This knee is bent. This toe is floating up, down. Incline body, folding forwards, abs it in. You're working on balance, posture, as well as working on your thighs, on your seat. Surprise people. When I start to get a little bit more views, when I start to get more of a following, maybe this video isn't a lot of views right now. Probably memes out of me. You know how people do. And that expression when you're working out and it's tough would be like me going. <sighs> we go up, down, three, up, down, two, up, down, one more, up. Down, now float the leg, up and away. Flex the foot, toe, forward, lift. Woo! It should burn here. It should definitely burn here. Thighs and see, let's go. You have just 10 pulses. Nine, eight, seven, other side in six, five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna have to have a shake, sorry. Okay, other side, feet wide in the hips, drop, left leg. Sink into the squat, push the hips backwards. If you felt this one, join this workout, make sure you give me a thumbs up and a comment down below when we finish, but only when we're finished. Seeing as this burns so much, let's think about all those benefits. If you've done a few of my workouts, you'll know I'm really into like the biology of fitness, good things it can do for your body. But here's a few quick ones now. Build bone density. You're making your bones stronger. That means you're less likely as you get older to fracture and break bones. You're making them stronger. Woo! 
lift. Did you know as well, keeping active reduces your chances of getting dementia by about 30%. That is crazy. So keep active, guys. Go down, lift, four, lift, three. Exercise also increases energy levels, helps you sleep last one, hold the bend, float the toe up, take it down for two, float the toe up, take it down for two, and also it releases when you're working out a really happy hormone. It'll give you a natural happy high after your workout. That is probably the only thing keeping me going right now. <laughs> Lift it up. Bring it down. Lift it up. Bring it down. One more. Bring it down. Okay, we can do it. You're gonna lift the leg up and away from the floor. I'm struggling today. Toes are forward. Little. Lift. Lift. Inhale. Exhale. So you're really working on this stabilized leg as well. Keeping it nice and steady. You're working as well on obliques, waistline, because you're trying to get that body upright. Go lift the leg. Up. Up. We're going down to the floor for another bit of booty work. Woohoo! In. Ten. Nine to the floor. In eight. In seven. Get the height leg higher. You've got five. Four. Three. Two. I want to Oh. Down to the floor. Oh, it's not right to cry in a YouTube workout, is it? You're going to bring both the forearms now to the floor. So both the forearms are down. Your right leg extends back. Toe comes a little bit higher than the hip. Hips are to the floor. Now we're going to go tap, lift, tap, lift. Who else is really enjoying the music today? It's keeping me going, I think. We go tap. Hips are down to the floor. Do not sink into your supporting hip. So if your supporting hip, the knee on the floor, if that hip is aching, try shifting the weight into the opposite forearm. You need to make sure that side of your body is like it's pressed up against a brick wall. Well, if you'll also feel this one in the abs, tap. Lift, we've got this. Eye line in between your fingertips. Keep those abs squeezed in. Tap, lift, we've got this four. Let's go, three, working on your gluteus maximus. Two, last one, now hold. Toe comes to the floor. Then press, then press. Now don't let this hip roll to the floor. Keep the hips nice and square. Pull the abs oh, in, yeah. strong and tight, then press. Then press, then press. You'll feel it in your hamstring. You'll feel it in your gluteus maximus, your butt. That is where I want you to feel it. We are sculpting ourselves a perky round bottom. Everyone is gonna be jealous. Commit to your workout. Woo -hoo -hoo. The more you exercise now, the more time you're gonna have in your lifetime because you are making yourself healthier. You're making yourself more active. So commit to that workout with me today as it really starts to burn. You have just 10, nine, other side in eight, in seven, in six, get a leg higher. Five, four, three, two, one. Other side, forearms down. Double check, is it the other leg working? We go down, lift, one beat, one lift, one drop, one up. Forearms to the floor, abs are pulled in nice and tight, eye line is to the floor. If you can feel it in the neck, may bring the eye line a little bit forward. Keep the abs in, chest to the floor, hips to the floor. Let's work on building your booty today. Commit to your workout. We're in this. We go, tap, lift. It is also a super hot day in the UK today. It's like 19 degrees, 20 degrees, which is hot for the UK. If you're watching in Canada and the US, you're probably like, that's not hot. But here it is. We used to like two degrees. It feels like a rain all the time. Tap, lift. You've got five, four more, three. Don't sit into that hip as you start to tire. Two, last one. Now hold. 
Keep the leg up, flex the toe to the floor, bend press, bend press, bend press so it is a miniature bend. I don't want you to do this. No, it's tiny. Again, you're thinking about that eccentric elongation of the muscle, adding pressure, adding resistance. Push something heavy away with your heel. If you can't feel it, make sure hips to the floor. That supporting side is up against the wall. Maybe try walking the leg one inch higher. I want you to be trembling. I want you to be shaking. Then press, then press. We have 20 more seconds left. And then we're going to your abs. Woo! Bend press. Bend press. Let's do this. Bend squeeze. Bend squeeze. You have just 10 presses. Nine, eight. Abs are coming up in seven, in six, in five. Bend press. Four, three, two, one. Straight away, we are going to stretch at the end, I promise. You're going to roll yourself onto your back. You're going to bring it all the way to the floor. Now bring your right leg into a tabletop. Bring your left leg into a tabletop. Bring the hands underneath your thighs. You're gonna tuck your chin to your chest. Lift the head, neck, shoulders up and away from the floor. So I really want you to, as much as possible, keep your eye line forward. Keep the head forward. I know it's so tough. You're kind of watching me do this. Do this, do this. I know. But try and listen to my voice and just hold up here. So, chin is into the chest. You've got a golf ball between your chest and your chin. Your upper abs are on fire. Switch off the arms. Switch on the upper abdominals. The right leg squeezes away from yourself. Option one, modification is here. Both hands underneath the thigh. Option two, one hand away. Start to squeeze this heel. Down, down. Let's add a little flex actually. It's easier for the brain. Squeeze. Squeeze, so this leg that's long, push in, down, down. The heavier you push with the heel, the more intense it's gonna get. Option two, let's bring this other hand away. Wherever you are, squeeze the heel as heavy as you can. Let's do this, 10 squeezes, nine, eight, legs come back in, in six, in five, in four, in three, two, one. Now bring the leg back in. Inhale, exhale. If you want to have a little breathe here, if you're up to the challenge, keep the hands away. Other leg away. Flex the heel. Push, push. Modification. This hand is here. Wherever you are, squeeze this heel to the floor. So you're in your abs section now. You're right now working your abdominal wall. So give me everything. Think about sculpting yourself that brand new waist. Commit to your workout today. Squeeze, you have just seven, six, five, four, change coming up in three, two, bring the leg in, hands under the thighs, chin to chest, lift the head, neck, shoulders, one inch further. This leg is going to go back out, one hand away, pull, pull, pull it up, option. We can do this, other hand away. Is it normal to have sweat underneath your eyes? I'm really struggling with that right now. Go lift, lift. You've got six, five, back in, and four, three, two, one. Back in, Woo! other leg away, one hand away. Pulse, pulse. Next option, advancement. You are nearly at the end of your workout, so commit to that burn, reach, reach. Inhale. Exhale, reach that leg that's away from yourself. You have six, center in five, four, three, center in two, one. Back through center, chin, chest, lift up. One leg goes away, now switch. Let's do this. We go switch, switch. Now this is the end of your workout. Are you ready to give me everything? One hand away, option. Let's do this. Other hand away. We go cycle, switch. You have your stretch. Coming up super soon. Head, neck, shoulders off the floor. 25 more seconds. And then we're going into your stretch. Further option. Keep the head, neck, shoulders off the floor. Do you want to burn? I know you do. Let's go. Switch, switch, switch. Woo! That burns. You have just. Let's do this, 10, 9, 
eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, well done. Knees in towards your chest. Give yourself a little rock side to side. Left to right, left to right. You're gonna bring your knees off to your right side. Left arm goes long. Head goes to the side, nice deep breath in. Nice deep breath, exhale, bring the knees to the other side. This time just comes out, bring the head all the way over. Knees through the center, rock back, rock forwards. Little frog stretch. Bring the soles of the feet together. Open the knees out. Let the side of the knees push down to the floor. You'll feel this in towards your hip flexors, into those inner thighs. Drive the outside of the thighs down to the floor. Then, bring the feet in front of yourself. Reach the hands up and sweep all the way over towards your toes. Now, I always say this, but don't worry about how far you can or can't get. Just really work with your own body here. Let the crown of the head push towards your feet. Let the nose fall in between your shins. Slowly roll yourself all the way up. You're gonna bring both the feet, sweep them round towards the back. No downward dog today. You're gonna tuck the toes under, come into a little crouch position. Inhale the breath in, exhale, push the hips all the way to the ceiling. Let the head dangle down, lengthen behind the back of the legs. Find that nice deep hamstring stretch and let the crown of the head fall super, super heavy. Now let the spine go, let the arms go and just hold. Find a bend through the knees, slowly roll yourself all the way up and away from the floor, ripple through all the vertebrae. And well done in your tailor toned bar sculpting class today. I hope you loved that 30 minute barless bar class. That squat with the side lift really, really burned. Definitely got into the side of my booty. I'm gonna feel that one tomorrow. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you've got any feedback or if you have any requests, drop them down below in the comment section. Most importantly of all, hit subscribe and I will see you again next time. Bye.